all right so finally google released the first public beta of android 15 i have already installed it on my pixel 8 here as you can see and i am also installing it on my pixel 6 here so it is ready so i'll just restart this device till then i have it installed on my pixel 8 and as you can see vanilla ice cream and the build number so i'll tell you guys how to install um android 15 beta 1 on your pixel devices so uh all the pixels from pixel 6 will support um android 15 so all you have to do is go to your um, browser minus chrome um search for search for android beta program uh, it will be the first link just tap on it make sure you have uh, your account signed into this web page and then you can tap on view your eligible devices scroll down and as you can see pixel 8 pro pops uh, right there um, so just opt in and you'll get the first beta of um, android 15 so we'll quickly go into settings scroll down to about phone go to android version as you can see and android version vanilla ice cream and the the easter egg is still android 14 um i think that will be updated in the later versions of the beta but for now it's the same as um android 14 um security patch is april 5th so this is the new one um and the bill number is ap31240322018 um I also feel that I should check for the um, update for the play services so um, let's see check for updates okay so it's saying that it is up to date so I don't have um, anything to worry about yep so it is up to date um and this is the beta one i was already running the developer betas on my pixel 6 um i had it on my pixel 8 but i decided to divert it back to android 14 qpr beta because i was having issues with a few banking apps and stuff like that um so i decided to revert it to android 14 beta but now that the public beta is up i thought why not just install it on the phone here itself all right so my pixel 6 has also booted up um and i'll let it rest there um, because there's not much of a difference between these two devices but anyway the first thing google added to um the 15 beta 1 is you can now choose uh, whichever wallet you want for um, default payments so if i just open settings if i go into apps and if i just go to default apps and then if i open wallet app as you can see i now have the option to choose between different wallet and different apps um, based on my credit card so if i just select amex i'll once i tap it it will automatically um i think um tap my amex card um so i'll leave it to google wallet for now because that's what i prefer um, but that's the first thing that they have added to the android 15 beta 1 the next thing they have added is uh, wep network so if i go back real quick if i go to network and internet if i go into internet and if i scroll down to network preferences um, as you can see allow wep network so you can um, enable or disable it um, as per your wish and the next thing uh, they have added is uh, if i go back if i go to security um there we go and then if i scroll down to more security and privacy and then if you scroll down to cellular network security as you can see they have added these two new features where basically your cellular network will be more secure uh, in terms of encryption so um go ahead and read whatever this says and um yeah this is uh, something new that google has added into this new beta the next feature uh, i think i'll have to see if they still have it but they added this in the second developer beta if i go into app info real quick there we go so you now finally have uh, the option to archive the app wherein um, like ios devices do it you will just offload the um, data of the app from your phone and once you tap on it again it will just install all the data back so i'll quickly do it for one of the app let's say soundcloud if i just archive it there you go 
so the app is now archived and then if I just tap on it it will download and re-download all the data that um, I had of the app itself so all my songs and everything will be automatically um, installed and will be automatically downloaded in the app itself so yeah I mean that's that's really really nice so they have added a thing um, for notification cooldown they have also added uh, a feature or they will add a feature um, in the future for customization on the lock screen so you'll be able to add widgets to the lock screen just like um, iOS devices are capable to do uh, but it will only be available for the Android tablets so yeah I mean that is pretty much it this um, was a short overview of Android 15 developer beta 1 uh, if more features pop up I'll definitely make a video on them as well um, also if you want any long term review of the pixel 6 running Android 15 or pixel 8 running Android 15 um, let me know down in the comment section I'll be happy to make a video on them as well but yeah other than that um, that is pretty much it for this video if you have any questions regarding this developer beta put them down in the comment section and I'll be happy to reply to you guys so yeah, that is pretty much it. Thank you for watching. Um, make sure you subscribe to the channel because more feature drops and more Android betas will be um, coming soon and I'll definitely make a video on them as well. So yeah, if you are a fan of Android betas, just hit the subscribe button. Um, so yeah, anyway, that is pretty much it. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next one.